High atop one of the hills which ring the teeming metropolis of Gotham City, a large house rears its bulk against the dark sky. Outwardly, there's nothing to distinguish this house from many others. But deep in the cavernous basements of this house, in a chamber hewn from the living rock of the mountain, is the strange, dimly lighted, mysteriously secret Bat's Cave, hidden headquarters of America's number one crime fighter, Batman. Yes, Batman clad in the somber costume which has struck terror to the heart of many a swaggering denizen of the underworld. Batman, who even now is pondering the plans of a new assault against the forces of crime. A crushing blow against evil in which he will have the valuable aid of his young, two-fisted assistant, Robin the Boy Wonder. They represent American youth who love their country and are glad to fight for it. Wherever crime raises its ugly head to strike with the venom of a maddened rattlesnake, Batman and Robin strike also. And in this very hour when the Axis criminals are spreading their evil over the world, even within our own land, Batman and Robin stand ready to fight them to the death. These boxes are usually locked. I know it. Captain Arnold, please. Captain Arnold speaking. I have a nice little package for you. You'll find it at the corner of First and Maple. Heavenly. Yeah, what's doing, Captain? It's the Batman again. He's at the corner of First and Maple. This time I'm going with you. Calling car 67. 67. That's us. Go to First and Maple. A-702. I'm warning you, Dr. Decker will make you regret this. Shut up! Dr. Decker? Who's that? Never mind, you'll find out. Let's wait around and see Captain Arnold's face when he gets here. No time for that, don't forget, I've got a date. Let's go. 